Non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, NAFLD, is the term for a range of conditions caused by a buildup of fat in the liver. 非酒精性脂肪肝病是因肝脏中脂肪积累而引起的一系列疾病的术语。It's usually seen in people who are overweight or obese. 通常发生在超重或肥胖的人群中。A healthy liver should contain little or no fat. 健康的肝脏应该几乎不含脂肪。Early stage NAFLD doesn't usually cause any harm. 早期 NAFLD 通常不会造成任何危害。But it can lead to serious liver damage. 但它可能导致严重的肝脏损伤。Even including cirrhosis if it gets worse. 如果情况恶化，甚至会导致肝硬化。Having high levels of fat in your liver is also associated with an increased risk of problems such as diabetes, heart attacks, and strokes. 肝脏中脂肪含量高也与糖尿病、心脏病发作和中风等问题的风险增加相关。If detected and managed at an early stage, 如果在早期检测并进行管理 it's possible to stop NAFLD getting worse and reduce the amount of fat in your liver. 有可能阻止非酒精性脂肪肝病的进展，并减少肝脏中脂肪的积累 Am I at risk of NAFLD? 我有的非酒精性脂肪肝病的风险吗 You're at an increased risk of NAFLD if you. 如果你符合以下情况，你患非酒精性脂肪肝病的风险会增加。You are obese or overweight. 肥胖或超重。Particularly if you have a lot of fat around your waist, people also call this an apple-like body shape. 尤其是如果你在腰部有一圈大量脂肪，人们也称之为苹果型身材。You have type 2 diabetes. 你患有二型糖尿病。You have high blood pressure. 你有高血压。You have high cholesterol. You have 高胆固醇 You are over the age of fifty. 你的年龄超过五十岁 You smoke. 你平时吸烟 However, NAFLD has been diagnosed in people without any of these risk factors, including young children. 然而，有些人即使没有这些风险因素，包括年幼的儿童，也被诊断患有非酒精性脂肪肝病 There aren't usually any symptoms of NAFLD in the early stages. 在非酒精性脂肪肝病的早期阶段，通常没有任何症状。You probably won't know you have it unless it's diagnosed during tests carried out for another reason. 除非在进行其他检查时被诊断出来，否则你可能不会知道你患有这种疾病。Occasionally. People with NASH or fibrosis who are at more advanced stages of the disease may experience. 偶尔，患有非酒精脂肪肝炎或在疾病的更晚期阶段出现纤维化的人可能会经历 a dull or aching pain in the top right of the tummy. 肚子右上部，肋骨下方的右下侧的隐痛或钝痛 Fatigue. 极度疲倦 Unexplained weight loss. 莫名其妙体重减轻。Weakness. 身体虚弱。If cirrhosis, which is the most advanced stage, develops, 如果发展到肝硬化，也就是最晚期阶段的话 ，you might have yellowing of the skin and the whites of the eyes. 你可能会皮肤和眼白会发黄。Itchy skin. 皮肤瘙痒。And swelling in the legs, ankles, feet, or tummy. 以及腿部、踝部。脚部或腹部会肿胀。NAFLD is often diagnosed after a blood test called a liver function test. 非酒精性脂肪肝病通常是在进行肝功能测试后被诊断出的。It produces an abnormal result, and other liver conditions such as hepatitis are ruled out. 测试结果异常且其他肝脏疾病，如肝炎，被排除掉之后，就可能会怀疑有 NAFLD. However. Blood tests don't always pick up NAFLD. 然而，血液测试并不总是能检测到非酒精性脂肪肝病。The condition may also be spotted during an ultrasound scan of your tummy. 这种情况也可能在对你腹部进行超声波扫描时被发现。If you're diagnosed with NAFLD, 如果你被诊断出患有 NAFLD。
Further tests may be needed to determine which stage you have. 可能需要进一步的检查来确定你所处的疾病阶段。Most people with NAFLD won't develop any serious problems. 大多数患有非酒精性脂肪肝病的人不会出现严重问题。But if you're diagnosed with the condition, 但如果你被诊断患有这种疾病 ，It's a good idea to take steps to stop it getting any worse. 采取措施阻止其恶化是一个明智的选择。There's currently no specific medication for NAFLD. 目前没有特定的药物来治疗非酒精性脂肪肝病。But making healthy lifestyle choices can help. 但做出健康的生活方式选择可以有所帮助。And treatment may be recommended for associated conditions such as. 治疗方法也许也会被建议用在相关疾病上，比如。High blood pressure, diabetes, and cholesterol. 高血压。糖尿病和胆固醇。Adopting a healthy lifestyle is the main way of managing NAFLD. 采用健康的生活方式是管理非酒精性脂肪肝病的主要途径。Lose weight can help. 减肥可以改善病情。You should aim for a BMI of 18.5 to 24.9. 你应该争取达到 18.5 至 24.9 区间的身体质量指数。Losing more than 10% of your weight can remove some fat from the liver. 减掉百分之十以上的体重就可以减少肝脏中的脂肪。A healthy diet helps too. 健康饮食也有帮助。Try to have a balanced diet high in fruits, vegetables, protein, and carbohydrates. 尽量保持均衡饮食，多吃水果、蔬菜、蛋白质和碳水化合物。But low in fat, sugar, and salt. 少吃油、糖和盐。Eating smaller portions of food can help as well. 减少食物摄入量也有助于改善。Exercise regularly. 定期锻炼。Aim to do at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity activity weekly. 争取每周至少进行150分钟的中等强度活动。Such as walking or cycling. 如走路或骑自行车。All types of exercise can help improve NAFLD. 各种类型的锻炼都可以改善脂肪肝。Even if you don't lose weight, 即使你的体重没有变化，病情也会得到改善。Stop smoking. 不要再抽烟了。If you smoke, stopping can help reduce your risk of problems such as heart attacks and strokes. 如果你吸烟，戒烟可以帮助减少心脏病和中风等问题的风险。NAFLD isn't caused by alcohol, but drinking may make the condition worse. 非酒精脂肪肝并不是由酒精引起的，但饮酒可能会加重病情。It's therefore advisable to cut down or stop drinking alcohol. 因此，建议减少或停止饮酒。Non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. NAFLD is the term for a range of conditions caused by a buildup of fat in the liver. It's usually seen in people who are overweight or obese. A healthy liver should contain little or no fat. Early stage NAFLD doesn't usually cause any harm, but it can lead to serious liver damage, even including cirrhosis, if it gets worse. Having high levels of fat in your liver is also associated with an increased risk of problems such as diabetes, heart attacks, and strokes. If detected and managed at an early stage, it's possible to stop NAFLD getting worse and reduce the amount of fat in your liver. Am I at risk of NAFLD? You're at an increased risk of NAFLD if you are obese or overweight, particularly if you have a lot of fat around your waist. People also call this an apple-like body shape. You have type 2 diabetes. You have high blood pressure. You have high cholesterol. You are over the age of 50. You smoke. However, NAFLD has been diagnosed in people without any of these risk factors, including young children. There aren't usually any symptoms of NAFLD in the early stages. You probably won't know you have it unless it's diagnosed during tests carried out for another reason. Occasionally, people with NASH or fibrosis who are at more advanced stages of the disease may experience. 
A dull or aching pain in the top right of the tummy, fatigue, unexplained weight loss, weakness, if cirrhosis, which is the most advanced stage, develops, you might have yellowing of the skin and the whites of the eyes, itchy skin, and swelling in the legs, ankles, feet, or tummy. Naffold is often diagnosed after a blood test called the liver function test. It produces an abnormal result and other liver conditions, such as hepatitis, are ruled out. However, blood tests don't always pick up NAFLD. The condition may also be spotted during an ultrasound scan of your tummy. If you're diagnosed with NAFLD, further tests may be needed to determine which stage you have. Most people with NAFLD won't develop any serious problems, but if you're diagnosed with the condition, it's a good idea to take steps to stop it getting any worse. There's currently no specific medication for NAFLD, but making healthy lifestyle choices can help and treatment may be recommended for associated conditions such as high blood pressure, diabetes, and cholesterol. Adopting a healthy lifestyle is the main way of managing NAFLD. Lose weight can help. You should aim for a BMI of 18.5 to 24.9. Losing more than 10% of your weight can remove some fat from the liver. A healthy diet helps too. Try to have a balanced diet high in fruits, vegetables, protein, and carbohydrates, but low in fat, sugar, and salt. Eating smaller portions of food can help as well. Exercise regularly. Aim to do at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity activity weekly, such as walking or cycling. All types of exercise can help improve NAFLD even if you don't lose weight. Stop smoking. If you smoke, stopping can help reduce your risk of problems such as heart attacks and strokes. NAFLD isn't caused by alcohol, but drinking may make the condition worse. It's therefore advisable to cut down or stop drinking alcohol.